How, how does this I mean, lizard get off to wearing no pants? That's poor choice of words. <laughs> <laughs> Better than anything you can get without a prescription. So, about that Smash Ultimate Direct. Direct? Yeah, dude. King Ragnarok, Simon Belmont, Richter. Super cool, dude. Yeah. Smash Ultimate's awesome. It is. It is the thing. But you're not watching that. You're watching ukulele, and I'm Josh. I'm Nathan. And yeah, it's on Arcade O on YouTube. Last time we went through a horrible maze and finally finished it. Gosh. And this time we're going into another horrible maze. Hopefully not. It's <laughs> it's in the name, Moody Maze Marsh. What's in a name? What's in a name? What's in a name? An in a name is letters, <laughs> feeling, personality, huh? heart, soul. Oh, there's a lot in the name. Exactly. I mean, you can say a name, and you already kind of know the person. Josh. Yes, I already kind of know you just by the name. Really? Yeah. Lizard use pages to make world even more amazing. More challenges of hating. Ooh, wow, there's a lot it's of It's the stuff gauntlet there. of hell. Nice. You can't fly over this because then you'd miss all the quills. Except I don't really care about quills. I thought we already killed that dude. Okay, 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 I get it. There's a lot, but it's not like an actual indoor maze. Thing, oh my gosh, it keeps going. The best thing about it, though, is it's not really a maze. I know, it's a gauntlet. All you have to do is follow the path. Dude. Find me the the quills, and we shall start this maze gauntlet of hell. I think that's it. Right there. Where? Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Okay. I have a question. And I have an answer. Do you? I do. How do you turn something upside down? Sorry, how do you turn a frown upside down? You stand on your head. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, that's so good. <laughs> <laughs> Very applicable in my real life scenarios. How do you take something that's meh and make it something that's uh? Ooh. How do you take something that gives you a headache and make it something that makes you want to celebrate. Ooh! Oh! Ow! Oh, we're going down? That was not what I expected. How How do you make something good out of something bad? How do you make a frowner and a downer into a smiler and a bewiler? I, I'm not sure. How do we enjoy ourselves in something that just seemingly makes us angry? You have to jump off of it fast, that's the only purpose for it. That's the only reason for that in the gauntlet. Oh, oh gosh. Man. Oh jeez. How how do we turn frowns upside? How do you make well, one way is to just believe it. Just believe? You just have to believe. Alright. I I need some positivity. Ukulele has been Mmm. They caught me. Taxing on my soul. Oh. It's beautiful. The characters are cute. It was made by more or less indie type people, dude. Mm. It's a successor to people's childhood game. Or it wants to be. And in yet, it has been taxing at times, painful even. Some, many people regard it as not a good game. Mm. How do you like it? How, how do I change my negativity? My awful perspective. You have to not look at the bad stuff. You have to start looking at the good stuff. But it's everywhere. Oh no, it's not everywhere. You yeah. just haven't looked hard enough. This whole level is green. So? It could do with some more color. Look, there are golden lights. There's fire. Have you seen fire in this marsh before? Isn't that amazing? All the way up there. Amazing. Look, these things look like cats. You can tongue a cat. <laughs> oh. Know any other game you could do that? You will enjoy this for hours. Oh wait, I have to I have to pull them? What am I doing? Oh You're pulling out a little platform. See, you were pulling out platforms no, with no, no, cats' no. tongues. You're pulling out a cat form. <laughs> yeah, see? It gives you laughs. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> this game is the most amazing thing the world has ever seen. You will love it or you're dead. <laughs> 
<laughs> is not that a threat? No, I'm just saying, if you don't love it, you're not living life. You are living with the life half full. I mean, half empty. <laughs> <laughs> you have to see the glass half full. I don't see a glass. I see milkshake on the ground. Ooh, oh. <laughs> yeah, milkshake. <laughs> oh, it's on the ground. Um, How can I see the glass half empty? I mean, half full. <laughs> If there is no glass, and all I see is milk all over the ground. Um, you don't cry over it. Yeah, that's true. You cry under it. <laughs> <laughs> you get somebody else to clean it up for you. Yeah. You cry for them. Oh, sorry. You cry for them, Argentina? Don't cry for me, Argentina. No. See, what's not to like? It's green. Love green. Why don't you love green? You like green? Aren't you ankle-friendly? Aren't you ankle-friendly? <laughs> yes, friendly to your ankles. The color I green. Try to be. Why the heck is this sinking? <laughs> Just like, huh, that's weird. <laughs> it was! I'm going down and dying. Hmm. Weird. <laughs> well, I guess this is my time to die. Pipes. This is like a Mario game. Mm -hmm. Everyone loves Mario game. Oh, crap, it's a race! Help! Everyone, please go detect the various awful platforming curse! <laughs> He even thinks it's awful. <laughs> You'll need to be quick to beat his time lock and beat his big face. Dag. He's got a big nose, dude. A long nose. Like Rudolph, the long nose dragon. That went places. That's <laughs> <not> weird. <laughs> oh, sorry. I was supposed to be rolling. Ah. Whoa, that was, that was lovely. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. You're Best still times. loving this? I am loving this. You don't have to love something to like it. What? To enjoy it. You can hate something and enjoy it. <laughs> can you really, though? You can. Can you? It's all in the mind. Yeah. Deception. Convince yourself. Convince yourself that it is lovely. That's what this accent. Oh, that was easy. Uh -huh. the, what was that about? See? Look, the game has gotten easier. What's not to love about this? If you love easy... It's simple! Name me one thing that- just one, don't go overboard! <laughs> <laughs> one thing that you think is bad about this, and I will show you how it is actually not. The inept boss battle. Crap, that, I mean, that was bad. There's, there's no getting, no, there, there's no redemption. That was just bad. There, There is no redemption for that. The maze we just went through. The maze, oh, that that was a, a learning experience. That was, that was thinking outside of the box. Did you know that invisibility can reverse the direction of lasers. No, because that makes no sense. <laughs> but it happened. It, it was did. amazing. <laughs> wasn't no, it, it wasn't. Amazing? <laughs> it was weird. It was something never tried in other games. You have to think out of the box to beat this game. Look at this. Platforms that you have to jump from window to window. Ever see that? No. I feel like I have. No, you haven't. <laughs> this is on the bridge technology. <laughs> the blur. The blur. <laughs> Oh, hey. Yep, and the only kid-friendly game where you can shove your tongue in some dude's mouth. Mmm. That's disgusting. I mean, I could feed him. Feed him I what? I don't really feel like it. Ice? Yeah. Fly! Okay, one thing about this game I love is flying. There's nothing better than flying. It's cheating. It's wonderful. Is that really what you feed him? I feed him anything I got. He ate grenades once. But would he eat fire? I don't know. He might. It's just... See? Don't you love the game now? Well, okay, explain to me this. It's trying to be the, the spiritual successor to Banjo-Kazooie. Yes, it is. What? Except one thing. Yeah? Banjo wore pants and a backpack. Mm-hmm. Where does this... How, how does this I mean, lizard get off to wearing no pants? That's poor choice of words. <laughs> <laughs> but how does he just roam around pantsless? It's rude. Think about the children. Um, and Laylee, she's pantsless to everything, dude. Which is super progressive. See? Like Sonic's like, <laughs> pants, they're no good. But Amy's like, I'm gonna wear a skirt and a dress. 
That was amazing! What? You found that random thing <laughs> randomly! <laughs> Sorry, that was a bit too positive. I need to go back to being negative. See? Isn't it lice? Lice? Oh. Ew! Gross! <laughs> it, it's amazing. The miracle lice that is amazing. this game. Whenever a kid got lice, they're like, Don't come back into this place until we, like, contaminate it. I mean, decontaminate <laughs> <laughs> well, Going back, Amy's all like, I wear a dress, and, but you can look up my skirt. That is actually true. It's rude. I'm just like, why, dude? The skirt's way too short. Give her pants. It's like and then they did. They're like, we oh, can't yeah, give a did. girl a skirt. Then they'll think that they have to wear skirts. It's like it's like Minnie Mouse. She wears a skirt that you can totally see up. But it's fine because it looks like she's wearing a diaper. Hmm. And who's like... I'm not saying like that I think anybody would be turned on by Amy Rose. But... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> long pause. But I'm just like, game developers, why the short skirt? It's just weird. Meanwhile, Sonic's Ooh. nude. <laughs> nah, man, I've got shoes and stuff. Getting people got into the fetish glasses. Quick. Whoa, whoa. Nude butt shoes? Nude but with shoes? butt shoes. <laughs> <laughs> you seen these butt shoes? They're shoes with patterns of butts on them. Oh, I thought they were shoes for your butt. <laughs> you know, <laughs> when you're sitting on the ground and you kind of got to scoot around. Oh, that's smart. You need like, shoes for your butt. I'm sure those would be called butt pads. Butt pads? No, that this just sounds weird. Oh, no, because shoes for your butt yeah, sounds Yeah, that sounds better. so much more socially acceptable. Butt Holy shoes. crap, that was close. <laughs> sure was. Butt shoes. Butt shoes. Butt shoes. The new line from uh, Skechers. Yeah. Skechers be like, shoes is cool, butt shoes? Cooler. Mm. Well, you just said shoes twice. Na na na, silly person. Butt shoes. Yeah, you saying shoes and then butt shoes. Yeah, like shoes for your butt. My butt needs shoes. Yeah, your butt needs shoes. Why do I need to choose between the <laughs> butt shoes? They come in different sizes and colors and shapes. Oh, I thought it was a shape twice. I was like, this is aggravating. Why are we? No, oh gosh. Oh, right when I was about to give up. Keep <laughs> going back here. <laughs> Just leaves immediately. Dang. And tell me, why couldn't we come through the back entrance? Sounds like a complaint. I don't know. I'm, Sounds I'm like something saying. you don't like. I'm just saying, why couldn't we? It's just a question. So you're telling me you love everything about this game. I have to admit. No, I'm not saying I love everything about this game. I'm just saying this is how you make something good that otherwise would be horrible. Well, you know what? I, I should stop complaining because we're in a good part. Oh, the yeah. maze was awful. This was good. Yeah, this is decent. Hey, what's up, chick? Uh, hello there. Well done for surviving one world without being captured <laughs> wow. and cooked. That's rude. Hello. I didn't expect to see other adventures where here. Actually, you might be able to help me obtain my next artifact. Why do we keep helping you? Yeah. Treasure hunting. From the look of you, I don't think you. Your heart's in it. <laughs> <laughs> she has no heart. There's a valuable gem hidden inside that cave. However, it's behind thick glass that a modest explorer like me has no chance of breaking. Mm. Just look at it, I'm sure it'll break. Mm. Do you think you could retrieve the gem for me? In exchange, I'm sure I could source one of those golden pages that are all the rage these days. No. Eh, yeah, why not? Alright, lazy bones, we'll find your gem. Do you have to make a joke every time you talk to her? Heck yeah. How wonderful. Please bring the treasure straight to me once you've recovered it. Don't sell it to the Shovel Knight. <laughs> <laughs> Got more jokes about her. She's yeah. the type of person that'll give you the shirt off her back. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of creepy. Dude, it's Tron. It immediately got better. Yeah, it did. That was weird. Just keep screaming and shouting. It's just weird. Watch out. There's a rock. Never yeah. know what these rocks might do. It's eyeballs. Oh, no. Oh, dang it. He took up the ice cube. He's dead. Got him. Perfect. 
This is weird. Kind of reminds me of Doom. Oh, that was the gem? Oh. We got it. We're a real next gem adventures. Oh, gosh. Get it? I know you've got it! Thank <laughs> goodness, pray you're here! I'm surprised I walked all the way back to the whatever. You were watching me the whole time. Nope, I'm leaving. Goodbye, <laughs> this gem's mine. <laughs> that mushroom has come to life! And it's leaving. Oh, okay. Sure. Whatever. Yeah, that's good. I don't need it. Here's a gem. Oh, she's so happy. Uh, we've recovered the gem. You already knew that, though. <laughs> My oh, goodness, and just when I was about to give up and find another buddy duo. Was Banjo here? Yeah, sounds like something I'd like to do. <laughs> <laughs> we found some other collectibles there too, which was a bonus. <laughs> Did we? I didn't see anything. No. Please accept this gold trinket as a sign of my appreciation. Some of the swamp creatures were using it as a napkin. At least not toilet paper. Mm. I think I've earned a break from all this excitement. Until we meet again. She's never gonna show up again? Nope. See you She's later. She's gone. That's it. <sighs> She's done for. She's pretty brainless. Mm. I, I, no, I was thinking of a bones joke and I couldn't get it. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> bones. Bones, bones, bones. What rhymes with bones? I don't know. I mean, I, I tried to think up the joke, but I think I need to flesh it out a little <laughs> bit more. <laughs> Well, that's all the time we have for today. Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. Everything you do to keep us going through lovely mazes instead of annoying mazes. More like gauntlets, to be honest. Join us next time where we continue through the gauntlet of the Moody Mars maze. And we uh, find more pages so that we can finally go to new places, do new things, and ah, all that stuff. Moral of the story is no matter how bleak and grim the situation might seem, there's always th positivities to find. So look for them no matter where they might be hiding. Watch this. Fan and fan and on fan on. Oh.